And now, preview time. When it comes to entertainment, you can't beat a good film. So let's take a look at what's coming your way. When the light of democracy goes dark. What was that? And the people find themselves without power. Dastardly evil stalks them through the darkness. Carbon dioxide. A freedom. Defacing democracy. One face at a time. You are traveling through a broken dimension. A demented dimension. Not only of active motive, but of mind. A journey into a frustrating land with boundaries untouched by imagination. Next stop, the quarantine zone. Hey, Chad. Oh, hey, Janet. So did you see the news? Uh, yeah, I think I caught some of it anyway. Yeah, did you see the part about the zombie outbreak? Oh yeah, you know, I did catch something about that. Seems pretty serious. You know, telling everyone to take shelter, stay indoors. Yeah, but, I mean, you know. No, what? I mean... Come on, you know. Okay, I don't know whatever you know, Chad. So if you could just tell me what you know. It's fake news. What? You didn't actually believe any of that, did you? It was pretty convincing, so yeah, I did. There were military folks, epidemiologists, yeah. other experts, and even potential footage of zombie attacks. Crisis actors. I don't think... Well, okay, but I mean, what channel did you watch it on? All of them. It was literally all that every channel was talking about. Dr. Evers, over here. Uh, uh, why are people biting other people? I know you guys have a lot of questions, and our working theory is zombies. If I take my grandmother's teeth out, is she still a threat? Army Brass has confirmed. It is zombies. Oh god, no, no, no. Oh god, oh god. Oh yeah, bro. It's zombies. I mean, I was watching the Murdoch News Network. I said every legitimate channel. And on there, they were just saying that this was all just part of the lamestream media's attempts to steal focus and attention away from Trump's coronation. So yeah, we're good. You have to know that this is not a false flag issue. It's literally the apocalypse. Fake news, as Shakespeare would say. 
I don't think he said that. Oh, yeah. It was in Twelfth Night or some shit. Yeah, no. No, yeah, I read it. Yeah, okay, yeah. and if it's fake news, why are you boarding up your door? Oh, this? This has nothing to do with the news. Does it have to do with your arm being eaten outside of the door? Because that seems like it would have something to do with the zombie outbreak. Oh. No, that's not a zombie thing. That's just Brad. You know Brad from Three Doors Down? Hmm. Huh. Hey. Three Doors Down. They were a good band. Whatever happened to them? The Bush era. What? Nothing. Not not sure. Don't you think that Brad out there is a zombie? I don't think so. I'm no expert, but I don't see any reason to jump to that conclusion. You don't? Well, okay. Did Brad show cannibalistic inclinations before the apocalypse that isn't happening happened? Hmm. I don't know. I mean, I know I was a meat eater, but we never really talked specifics. That doesn't seem to be zombie-like behavior to you? Well, I don't know. Again, not an expert, so I don't typically like to comment, but... It seems pretty flu-like to me. Seriously, flu-like? Yeah, like... Like he's got the flu or something. Your arm's off. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, shit. Yeah, that, uh... Yeah, that whole thing is gone. Damn. Brad is hungry, am I right? And it seems like the flu to you? Viruses evolve, Janet. Jesus, fuck off, Brad. Oh my god. So now you believe in evolution? Well, for viruses, yeah. Not for monkey people. Jesus, Janet, get a grip. Speaking of, uh, do you think there's any way you could give me a hand with this? Uh... Oh, sure. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, no. Zombie bite ruining your social summer? Not sure how to go about your day without putting those around you at risk? Try our latest product, a tonic of indifference. But I might be infected. Can I really go out and risk others' lives? You're right. Fuck them. <laughs> Indifference. Get some today. That's right, everyone. It's a new day in the U.S. of A. So if you're going out, then do your part and wear a mask. On the trails and indoors as well. Just mask up and help stop the spread. Until the day this all magically disappears. This message was sponsored by the Coalition for Not Being an Asshole. That's right, you too cannot be an asshole today. Just wear a fucking mask. Thanks for the assist. It's the least I could do. Uh, yeah. Probably. So, why are you here again? And is that your bailout bag with the M16? Yeah. Respect. Thank you. I'm here because zombies already overran my place. Oh, shit. Yeah. Really? Damn. Yeah. What about Buttercup? The dog? Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> Julie and I broke up a few months ago, and Buttercup was her dog, so she took her dog when she moved out. Uh, shit, I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't know that you two broke up. Oh, you... you didn't? No, 
Not at all. Yeah, well, it's just, you asked about Buttercup. Her dog. No, not, not her. <laughs> um, are you, are you doing okay? You look a little rough. Yeah, I just, uh, I think I probably caught a little something from Brad. It's all. Really? Yeah, just, you know, like a little bug or something. Or like, zombification? Shut up, no. You know, now that the symptoms are settling in, it does feel a little bit flu-like. Seriously, the flu again? Yeah, well, I mean, I feel a little fluish. So like, fever? Yeah, you know, uh, fear, yeah. Also chills? Yeah, indeed. E even with the temperature rise, so that's weird. Headache? Yeah, yeah. A bad headache. Slight craving for human flesh and brains? Maybe, yeah. Uh, ever so slightly, we'll say. I mean, it's, it's there, but it's not, you know? You know, it could be the flu. That's what I'm thinking. You know, if you're serious, I might have a flu shot in here. Oh, really? You have one? That, that's cool. Very lucky. Say, you don't happen to have any of that malaria drug on you, too, would you? I hear good things about that. No, sorry, but uh, I do hear that the newest flu vaccine has a tiny bit of the malaria one and disinfectant for good measure. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. And that's the one that you got? Yeah, sure. Yeah. S sweet. Awesome sauce. Well, I'm going to look away, though, because I'm not a fan of needles, so... Yeah, you go ahead and do that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, wait, it's not microchipped, is it? No. No. I got the non-microchipped ones. Mm -hmm. Smart. Yeah. Smart. You're a thinker. <laughs> this might pinch just a little bit. 